and town of Biloela has painted, was painted pink over the weekend as the community came together to celebrate the Nutter Salingham family's youngest daughter turning five. It was Thanika's first birthday outside of detention and for more we are joined by their family friend Bronwyn Dendle from Biloela. Great scenes. Br oh just beautiful. Yeah. Bronwyn it's been a massive journey for you all. How was yesterday's party? Good morning. Yeah, it was just wonderful to see um, everybody just so relaxed and happy and together at the park. And there's been so many moments over this weekend where you, you kind of pause and think, is this is this real? This is really happening. Um, and then yesterday... When there's I, a lot I of love my... there, isn't there, for this family? Oh, absolutely. There really is. And yesterday when I just watched my kids running around, playing in the park, laughing and pushing each other on the swing, I thought, oh, my gosh, this is what it's all been for, this moment, you know, right here. And I love that the birthday was pink-themed. It must have been so wonderful to see a smile on Thanika's face. It was. She was smiling from ear to ear and then her special little uh, koala cake made by their local friend Marie as well brought another big smile to her face. So she just had the most wonderful time. It was, it was a great day. I would, I'd imagine they'd be looking forward to the day when, when they don't have the cameras around, they just get back to normal life, right? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, they're so relieved and hopeful and excited about what, what the future is bringing. But I think after this little media storm subsides, yeah. they can get back to, to life and, and looking forward to that peaceful, secure life. And so they're now awaiting permanent residency. The Prime Minister has said there should be no impediment to that process. How long do you expect that will take? Yeah, we're pretty excited and waiting for news. You know, we're hopeful it'll be sort of weeks. Um, you know, it's certainly a lot quicker under an Albanese Labor government than it was going to be under a uh, Dutton Morrison LNP government. But we've waited this long, so we, um, we're happy to just wait another, you know, week or so to, um, yeah, to get that news that they get to live in safety and certainty here in Billow. You think it'll just be that, that amount of time? We're hopeful, yeah. We know the wheels are in motion and, yeah, um, yeah the process, they've just got to dot the I's, cross the T's, do it properly um, for a change and then, um, yeah, we can, uh, we can have them here permanently. You must be pretty proud of yourself too and all the work that's been done. Well, yeah, proud of the whole community and, and, and indeed Australia for standing up for this little family and what they represent to the rest of the nation. It's, it's been an incredible journey. Here, here. Yeah, Great job. Well done, huh?